Alright, let's see where we're going. This is the furthest I've been from home. Can't believe I got all the way down here. This is the furthest I've been. That was the furthest I've been. This is the furthest. How big is this map? Hmm. Quite far. I think I want to kind of head in this general direction. Through the town. He bought them fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Now don't make me come in there and shoot up that little trading post of yours. Whoa, whoa, easy there, Mr. Power Armor. This doesn't involve you. Mr. Power Armor. What's going on here? That's a simple business dispute, got it? Trudy's sitting on a pile of goods that she owes me. I tried reasoning with her, but it looks like I gotta take what's mine by force. Want to make some easy money? Help me out. I could use another gun. Or maybe you think you can talk some sense into her. I'll talk to her. Maybe we can work this out. I appreciate it. If things go sideways, we'll back you up. I'm the muscle, babe. Just don't piss me off, right? <laughs> He's the muscle. Hello, Trudy. What's happening? Hey there. I saw you in that poison cellar talking. Well, he ain't getting his money. Period. Why? What's this all about? Oh, that Ken Pusher didn't tell you? He got my boy hooked on Jet. Sold him a ton of junk on credit. And now he expects me to pay him off. That bastard ain't getting a single damn cap from me. Look, you owe them money. If you just pay them, then this'll be over. Everyone walks away without getting hurt. I got a better idea. You take care of Wolfgang. I'll pay you a hundred caps to put a bullet between his eyes. <laughs> what do you reckon, guys? And why should I help you? Look, this place might not look it. But caravan Kill him. Through here, okay. okay. I have supplies. You help me, we can trade for whatever you need. I'll get rid of him. Thank you. I'll back you up from here. Go get him. Big mistake. I'll kill all you chem pushers. Come on. Watch out, my new sniper. Wolfgang, there he is. Oh. Where's Trudy? No more drugs, young man. Stay clear of the drugs. Okay, that's what I like to hear. Better not, I'll be watching. Bye. <sighs> I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. Now, if you ever need to trade, my shop's open. Help Trudy. Everyone wants me to help the store lady kill Wolfgang. Oh, I think I made the right decision. I've got a few minutes to browse. It's all worth every cap I'm charging. I supposed to take out this whole place. Hmm, could have a bed here, could have an opportunity to save the game. Get 
I love to hide those birds in random locations. Bunch of goals. Yeah, I'm not I don't tend to use the med kits to heal as much on survival because because of the um I think it's chemicals, isn't it, in the stim packs. I got an idea. Oh no. Oh no. That's not good. Tell you what, without my shotgun, things just don't go smoothly. the back of my power armor then <laughs> one down level up I don't know man I need to think about leveling up that's something I'm going to need to think and, and work out where to put the point I think I might put it on scrapper anyway so because I need nails I need so many nails and then if I put it on scrapper, then when I scrap stuff, I'm going to get nails from it. And that's what I need in the moment.
Hi. Oh, there's got to be a mattress somewhere around this joint. There's got to be. Where do these people sleep? He has no nukes left. Does he only have one nuke? Oh. Hey, Jauncey. Welcome, buddy. Excuse me. Thank goodness for that. So from now on, I'm not I'm not leaving home without loads of shotgun shells. Sleeping, he looked so dead. <laughs> Sleeping zombie. <laughs> oh, this place is bad. Is this a bad place? Is it? Is this? Is this? Is this a bad place, man? So I've got a lot to lose if I die. A lot to lose. I just need a bed. I just need a bed. So I'm so I'm asking for is just one mattress. One old mattress. Man, I'm so nervous now. You guys have said that. No beds, just ghouls. Okay, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. It's like Ghoul City, this place. Just gotta work out how on earth I got in. Where's the front door? Oh. I think in one of the back rooms there's a bed. What, in this building? Oh man, I've been, it's like an hour's worth of gameplay. If I die, I'm gonna lose an hour's worth of gameplay.
got no ammo. <sighs> Ammo. Yeah, it's going pretty good, Angelica. Thanks. Thanks for asking. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. It's really good. Yeah, it's nice. I like working out in the community the best. How's your new job going, Angelica? Okay, right, where am I going for this mission now? Um... Okay, so it's this building, which is basically on my left. So it's the main, the main building up here. Absolutely, loads of them. Factory is massive, is it? Oh, you didn't break anything. Oh, wow, amazing. Surely he's dead from that. Oh, that is a massive jump. Tell you what, this sniper packs a punch. It's a humongous factory, isn't it? Oh, I see him up there. Do you know what, though? For the interiors, I bought the minigun with me, so when I get inside, I can get the minigun out. I'm just trying to save ammo at the moment. So you had a date, Joshua. I went to a movie and ate some steak in a steakhouse and went back to her place for a bit. Mm. Was it a good date? Was it your first date? Like, first date with this particular girl?
Oh crap. Man, the explosion the car explosions are massive in this game. Is that one gonna blow as well? Getting injured, taking some taking some damage. When she said we're having trouble with a gang, I thought it would be like a little encampment of, I don't know, about 10. This is like a whole flipping complex, isn't it? Here we go. It takes it takes a lot for me not to like someone. First night you came in, mouth began at Kings, and I said something to him, and he didn't like it too much, so he can't doubt it's because of the team. Stock up on cores when trading. They aren't easy to. Okay, good tip. Thanks. Do that. Yeah, he's, he's been friendly of late. I don't want to be rude, thanks, Zippy. Oh, look at the monkey. Oh, let's get the life out of me then. Wait, is that a bomb? Why did its lights change? Uh, shut the fuck up a second. I hear something. That's like a little, it's like a little sensor, isn't it? That tells them where when I'm near. Have I got my headphones the wrong way again? No. Uh, I'm hearing someone up above me, I think. I'm hearing someone around there, but it's a toilet. Unless they're hiding in the toilet. I'll deal with that.
Well, I told you you came in tonight trying to start with me right off the bat, so that's why I don't have time for you. Uh, I, I didn't know what he said to you. I thought he was being friendly to you. Oh, mate. Okay, I won't read you what he commented, Hippie, because you I don't want to make it worse. But he's being nice. Leg Spider was being um, a bit funny tonight, though. I thought he's normally. He's normally friendly. He was getting really frustrated because I wasn't going where he, want, he, he wanted me to go, where he was telling me to go. It can be the hard thing with playing old games sometimes when you stream. Like when you stream really old games, sometimes you can, you can get a lot of backseat gamers, you know. And it kind of ruins the video as well for other people because if I'm playing a game and, s and people are saying, I'll oh, go here, go there, then it's not really like I'm playing it for the first time. Do you know what I mean? A lot of people want to watch someone play it for the first time and they want to see you make mistakes as well, you know, like they did when they first played it. You guys got me stirred up over nothing. I must be going crazy. So I try to not just. Goodbye, head. Who said stealth wasn't good in this game? I think stealth works in this game. May not be the best stealth, but it works. Oh, okay, about the great boy, okay. Okay, down we go. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, highlight. It, it won't, it won't, it won't, um, it won't last forever or long. You're not really being painted as a villain, man. I think. Oh, wow. I'm sure, that wall just expanded then. That was a panic first shot. Then that was terrible, wasn't it? That first shot was way off. That was a panic. I hear him, but I don't see him. I think he might be on down here. Okay, I'm only going to do one floor at a time. Sweep the floor at a time. You should pick up the clipboards. They have screws, which can be used for weapon. Oh, thank you. That's a good tip. See, I like tips like that. That really helps. Screws are so useful when it comes to crafting. An elevator? That's just going to confuse things. Is that the way I come in? No. Is it on, is it? Just make sure you don't throw a grenade down there. Someone's 
got to get used to where these guns are. I can change them up a lot quicker. Is that the lift? Someone coming up? Where'd that little fucker go? It sounds like he's upstairs, man. He must be up there. This guy had some armor on, didn't he? He didn't go down with one shot. He was... It reminds me of Bioshock, all this talking. <laughs> so much fun this game. Dude. So much fun. Don't like these guys because they take two shots. Got some decent armor on them. Did you get another fusion core? Are you using the one from Red Rocket? Um, no, I got another one. I found one out in the middle of nowhere. Um, I found two. This is the third one. <laughs> I'm going through them like nobody's business. I'm not even running either. They kept in your ammo. I'm thinking there's got to be a fusion core around here somewhere. A power station, isn't it? There's got to be a fusion core. Got to be. I've only got two shotgun bullets, that's not good. Things are going to get tough without a shotgun. I thought they were mines then, but they look like donuts. See, this is the kind of place I might find one. If 
Basements are where they usually are, okay. Well, I'm gonna head down then. I'm running low. I'm gonna I must have shells, yes. Someone say something about the elevator. The elevator will take you directly to the guy you need to kill to complete the quest. Now he's going to have to ditch the power armor, probably. Components from the turrets are very useful. See, as well, the other thing is, once I ditch this power armor, I'm not going to have, I'm not going to be able to carry half of this stuff because my inventory is only like, what, I think it's 150 or something really low. So once I ditch the power armor, I'm screwed. Well, I should go and fight him now before the... And a hip. Hip fire. They always see me before I see them. Oh, did she have a grenade in her hand? What did she have in her hand? Oh, I think it was just a switchblade. It'd be great if I could find a bed before I tackle this big guy. Tired and low and fusing, yeah. No. Going again. Lower level.
Let's just add some caffeine now. It's gonna have to caffeine up on this. Keep me awake. I haven't seen a mattress anywhere. I know where he is. Well, I know where one of them is. I think he's using a stealth boy, I love it. I got no stealth boy. Wish I did. <laughs> Shot him in a kneecap. <laughs> uh, oh, but oh, he's still alive. There he is. Get him. Hold your breath. You know what? I think that out there is just the... Um, I think that's just the drone gun, isn't it, out there? <laughs> Kneecapped. I think that's just the drone. Take that drone out. That really? Oh, there it is. Okay, we've still got more. Staying caution. Yeah, I have very few weapons. <laughs> I don't have many weapons, do I? I'm just going on this. Okay, let's caffeine up again. Man, I can't even, I can't even, I can't carry. I've got so much stuff. Yeah, very little power, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's survival for you. I feel like I'm survive. I feel like I'm literally surviving. Just. I feel like I'm on the brink of survival, that's what I mean. Literally on the brink of survival. If I, if, oh, there's a bed. Well, that's good. There's a bed here. If I could find a fusion core, man, my everything would be great. Here we go.
Yeah. Yeah. It's like going in this thing when you've got no power core. But I'm not really going to be running around in here. To be honest. Um. I'm going to be more looking than I am running. Looking for those special things. I know there's a fusion core in here somewhere. I just got to find it. And I've got to eat. It's all good. Yeah, for the girls. Hey Ryan, Ryan EFC 14, welcome. Yeah, I killed a few of these ghouls. I'm not sure if they're going to respawn or whether they're dead. Dead, dead. Are oh, these rehydrate you? Take these and I'm going to eat them. I don't know if um, you guys know that's Bob Ross and Bob Ross is like a famous painter he was like a, he used to do like painting how to paint how to do an oil painting on TV he used to do like painting shows like years ago and somebody created like a fallout episode he, he created fallout Bob Ross episodes so he created Bob Ross with the fallout character and then put up loads of paintings and just created this whole Bob Ross how to paint episode with the fallout and that's that's from that let's go for this unusual word one Yes. One. It's not that. Lightness zero. Oh, so mask was none. No. But it's not the S. Could be the second S. Be that. But then it would have the A in. Then it would have had the B. It the B, maybe it's the B. What any other words that begin with B? Bin. It could be bin. 
I'm playing too right now. You're live, hey. Yeah, I am. Hey, hippie, welcome back, buddy. Bin, yeah, Ryan, I agree, mate. I think, I think, yeah, and you want to see. Okay, we're all going with that. I think it's got to be that because it must be the B. From the B from Boss. And Mask, it has no similarities to Mask at all. So it's definitely been. Yeah. That's it. Cool. That was a bit of joint joint work there, guys, wasn't it? High leg spider. Let's engage. Activate, activate this little dude. Hopefully he'll kill some of the ghouls for me. We'll see. It will get rid of a word and reese or reese. Yeah, I don't, I don't really, I just like guessing it. I usually get it. I like quite like the game. You know that. I think they're actually they're actually easier in this than they were in Fallout 3. There's like less there's less options. It's one of my favorite mini games actually. Open sesame. Yes. Oh yes. New gun? Why not? Yeah, very slow. Um, how do I melee? Yeah, very slow because I have no core, but also very slow because I just want to take my time. I want to basically play this game for about three months, and I just want to, I just want to enjoy it, take my time with it. Really, I don't want to rush or anything. So that's how I'll be playing it. A lot of building as well. I'm quite into the building of this game. I really enjoy the building. Yeah, it's not. But if you want to see a faster playthrough, then just watch the highlights. The highlights are good for that. I'm running out of food. I'm to drink some water. I've got any water left? I don't know if I've even got water. Wow. So low.
I don't know, I might try for some achievements later on. I've been told I can take the dog with me, he doesn't count. Yeah, I wanted to do the Lone Wanderer, because I needed the armor perk. Because on survival, it's just, you die so quick. So I thought that armor perk is going to come in handy a lot more than a companion. Companions don't really seem to do that much damage. Still not dead, still didn't kill him. It was a double shot, one in the body, one in the head. How's he still how did he live through that? They know when to attack you, don't they? They definitely timed that one well. Takes so long to get your health back on survival. Wow, that was a big jump, wasn't it? A massive little leap. Yes, at last, I've got it. Amazing. Yes.
Hey Fontaine, how's it going? Fontaine, thank you so much, buddy, for the for the donation. Um, I really appreciate it, mate. I'm gonna play it again, thank you, man, because uh, it's such a massive donation. Thanks a lot, buddy. Appreciate you watching all the streams you watch and the donation as well. Thank you for that. Finally, the beep is gone, yeah. Loot all the goals. I'll get their leg spider, man. Just, you know. Go in the hallway and make sure you looted the goal as it has a legendary weapon or oh, okay. Um, I'm just gonna pop that, I think. Finally, the people just gone, yeah. Yeah. It's cool, though. I can just fix it. I got two guns, really. Two. I've got two half decent guns is this shotgun and a pistol. I got a sniper rifle, which is really good, but in this situation. Oh, that's cool. Got the fusion core. What I was after. Now at least I can I can go back home in style. Oh crap. Thing is, as well on survival, like when you take the stim pack, it takes so long to heal you. So long. Like for myself to heal before I go back out there. The medicine perks might help with this impact situation. Yeah, I'm doing I'm doing a chemist as well at the moment for the antibiotics. Because I'm getting a lot of um, diseases and stuff and illnesses, so the antibiotics are really important. 
the moment for me, it seems to be. I've got lead belly to try and prevent that stuff, but still happening. How's survival go grind going? I miss did I miss anything yesterday? Well I basically went to Lexington yesterday. I arrived at Lexington. Um I went into the factory and I killed the guy. And now I'm just basically I just looted the super duper mart and now I'm heading back home again. That's all that's happened really. Did that first mission. It's going good though, I'm really enjoying it. It's really good fun. Really good fun. Just a normal Sunday, yeah. I haven't done that today. I did all that stuff. Can I do advance? I don't think I can do advance. Oh, so that's if you want to just enter that way. Because that is where the core is. That's where the good stuff is, basically. I'm good man. I've been playing a bit of Fallout myself, but not survival. I'm not cut out for that shit. <laughs> Disease is always... I think I think you've got to just be prepared to have a really slow, slow going game if you plan survival, I think. Because you've got to do everything so much slower. It's not as fast paced. Yeah, diseases are bad. You get a disease and you've pretty much finished. If you've got no antibiotics, you're pretty much finished, I've noticed. Because your health just goes down. Just keeps going down. No. No. And that, that, when that happens, and you've just spent the last 40 minutes collecting stuff, getting the core, surviving by the skin of your teeth, and then you, you're on your way home, and you step on the mine, and you're dead. Oh, man, that is a killer. That is a I knew I should have saved it. Just got back from Lexington. Lexington. Sorry. Oh, my one guard. He's standing there. He's the only guard I got. Oh, I got this guy as well, but he does his own thing. piece of news we've had around here for a good long time so we've been talking we decided if he came through for us we'd join up with the Minutemen again if we want things to get better we've got to start helping each other so we're in you can count on us if you need help down the line thanks again friend they're in does that mean I've got this camp as well does it So basically, to get more people, I just need a radio beacon, do I? My sniper would have killed that in one hit. You need beds and food too. Okay.
Was that one hit? Was that a one hit kill there? <sighs> Rest him quickly. You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. I guess you know I'm one of the last. <laughs> Last minute, man. Maybe not literally. Good night, hippie. Didn't there even know you were still there, mate. Former minute man out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy massacre. But we were the last active group. Take it easy, Hurricane. Thanks for watching, mate. How well? It's just me. Tomorrow should be on about 6 p.m. UK time. What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. Where the Minutemen betrayed each other and the people they were supposed to protect. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead. So I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord. As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up. But I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds. But that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. What makes you think I can do this? You saved us and conquered. There wasn't anything in it for you. You had your own problems to deal with, but you did it anyway. That kind of selflessness has been in mighty short supply around here for quite a while. Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Minutemen and the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way, General. Why are you calling me General? The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last minute man is there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. Another settlement has sent word that they need our help. Here's where they are. <laughs> I hope you can help them. That was mad. We've got to show people they can count on the minute man again. Some work. What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Yeah, it's nice, mate. You don't always have to chat. I'm pretty zoned out now myself, to be honest. 
Why do you need my help to build beds? Look, we got a lot on our plate, and we've been on the run for weeks. We need food, water, shelter, you name it. Well, you asked how you could help. I told you. Did you mean it or not? I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Hey, Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. <laughs> what we need now is a reliable source I've of... I've done this water. stuff. Wow. I'm on it. Clean water coming up. Great. Thanks again. Getting that XP. Sturgis. I feel better already. Knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help. But our food supplies are running low. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. Sturgis. Well, this place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with this. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. I'm on it. Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. Done all this stuff. See you, sports highlight, buddy. Bye, mate. Take care. Sturgis. Thanks for doing that. We'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Oh, feels good. I was glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door is always open to you. Windows, too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. I'm going to go before I completely fall asleep and just fall off the frame like this. Yeah. Okay. Good night, everybody. Take care. See you.